Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Leo. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for July, okay? So what do we have for Leo for July? We got two. We're going to take them. Keep in mind that not every reading is for you. Butterfly. A change for the better. So that's a change for the better. Okay, so, so that's a transformation. So this is a, a big, it's a massive change when you get a butterfly. Okay, it's a big change. Boot. Increase your efforts if you want to achieve your goals. So you need to increase your efforts this month. Okay, when you're going through a transformation, you're going to have to do some of the work. Okay, it's not going to be easy. Transformation isn't easy, but the beauty at the end of it is unbelievable. So you're going to need to increase your efforts this month. What do we have for Leo? What do we have for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? July. You got two. We got two so far. First card, act now, think later. Okay, so there's your increase your efforts. There's something you're going to have to do where you have to act with, you know, without analyzing. Okay, that this is like the Knight of Wands energy. Act now, think later. So you're going to, you're going to be put in some sort of position where you have to take action right now. Okay, secret admirer. You have a secret admirer, Leo. You do. You do. This person is hiding right now. They, you don't know who they are, okay? So the, hence the word secret. Some of you are like, oh, who could it be? The word secret is there for a reason. <clears throat> so yeah, you have a secret admirer. I guess we're going to take this one. It's interesting because when I started shuffling, this is the card that I saw. Not in this deck, but Page of Cups. So this is this is your secret admirer. This is your, You definitely have a secret admirer. Somebody, uh, look at this even says, I love you. I don't know if you can see it because it says, I love you. There's some, somebody loves you and they're hiding it. They're hiding. Somebody loves you, Leo. <clears throat> this could be, you know, a crush. It could be a crush. It could be a new beginning. It could be somebody. This could be like, uh, you know, a crushy kind of love. You know what I mean? It's the beginnings of love, that kind of thing. The Page of Cups brings news of love, okay? This is welcome news. So you're probably going to be receiving a message from this secret admirer by the looks of things. That's my guess. This person may send you something, may make you something. <clears throat> Excuse my throat. What do we have for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Doesn't have to be. What do we have for Leo? Knight or King of Wands. So it could be an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. That person could also be in your past tower, upright, right under secret admirer. Ten of Wands reversed. Ten of Cups reversed. Page of Wands, there's your admirer as well. Five of Cups reversed. Nine of Cups. Seven of Cups reversed, which is better in reversed. Um, one more card for Leo. Moon reversed, and then on the bottom we have the star reversed. So this may not be exactly what you asked for, but sometimes, you know, <clears throat> the universe has plans for you that you didn't expect because the tower is a universe card. <clears throat> 
<clears throat> Obviously, we have some communication issues because of my throat. The throat chakra is about communication. I've done some readings today. I haven't had this problem. King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. You also have Scorpio here. You have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius again. You have Pisces. You have Cancer. Um, you have Aquarius. I do believe that there is a decision that is being made as we speak. I think this is kind of like in your past, this person is watching you. They're definitely watching you. They are very interested in you. I, I feel like it's a strong fire energy. I mean, it could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio with fire in their chart or vice versa. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius with, you know, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. It could be a cusp, you know, a cusper, you know, Pisces, Aries, cusp, Aries, uh, no, and then we would have Scorpio, Sagittarius cusp, or um, what is the other one? Pisces, Aries cusp. Anyhow, um, it could be anybody. But anyhow, I do believe that whoever this person is that is, is admiring you, is uh in an un they may may have been in an unhappy relationship they're certainly not happy right now they wish that they could be with you they want to be with you um i feel like this person um has been hi definitely hiding their feelings for you we got the moon reversed they can see very very clearly that you are the best option they are very 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 attracted to you um this person uh, is going to make you an offer or an invite. They are going to communicate with you this month. So I think that you're going to be surprised. The tower is a surprise. Surprise! Surprise! This person may be breaking free from somebody right now. Right after that tower card is the ten of wands. They are letting something go. Or, they're, or they've got some sort of baggage or some burdens that they need to deal with right now. They may have been in a false sense of security that they couldn't find the strength to remove themselves from. A false relationship. Um, I feel like this person is really, it feels like they're pining over you or, or something like that. They want to, they're thinking about you a lot. They're really, really interested in you. Um, this person is going to take action towards you. It's going to be very spontaneous. They may give you a spontaneous offer and that's why you need to act now, think later. I feel like you are in a position, you're in a very, very strong position. You don't see it coming. You really don't. If you're taking on that King of Wands energy, the tower, you don't see it. You may be focusing on something completely different. You're not seeing it. You don't see it. And maybe you have too many responsibilities or something. This is reverse, but this is you got so much going on. You don't see this person. You don't see that the, you don't see that this person is interested in you. You know, um, because you got so many things in front of you, you're not realizing it. Um, but this is somebody that uh, is very, you have a lot in common with this person. It's kind of like shared values. This person sees that you have the same kind of interests. I do think you're going to be going in a new direction. Some of you are going to be moving or somebody is moving out of your home, whether it's you, could even be a child. There could be a change in a living situation. I know I'm changing the subject, but I do think that there's an there's upheaval on the home front, you know. Um, and maybe it's for the person we're talking about. We definitely have somebody here that is going with going through a change in their living situation. Um, there is a new love prospect here, definitely. Um, I feel like you have been, uh, there's definitely illusion here with the Seven of Cups and the Moon, but they're both reversed. This is coming out of illusion, coming out of fantasy, seeing very clearly what the best choice is. I feel like that's your person, and maybe you're going to be in that same position where you have to make a choice. There is somebody here that is making a decision and it is going to be a very clear decision. There is not going to be any confusion. It's going to be clear that this is the best decision. Somehow you are involved in this decision. You may be making the decision, um, but I'm not sure. This, may, this is not what you asked for, okay, because the star card is reversed. Somebody could be coming back around. You know, they, they're doing something and you're like, why is this happening? Why is this happening? Because that's, that's the star reverse. This is not what I asked for. Everything happens for a reason. Um, a change for the better. You do have a change for the, a, the better that is ahead. Your wishes are being fulfilled. You may not see it, but your wishes, this is nine of cups, that's wish fulfillment. 
um, you are going to be receiving an offer or an invite from somebody that you do not expect. This is a complete shock. It is a complete surprise. Okay. <laughs> I can even hold on to it. Okay, there it is. That's a complete surprise. Surprise! Okay. Um... I feel like whoever you are dealing with has been in a relationship. Maybe they've been in the relationship with the water sign. I don't know who this... There's definitely a water sign here. There's been secrets. There's been lies. There's been deception. This person has been focusing on the loss. They've been overwhelmed. They've been burdened. They, But I feel like now they've let go. They've let go of that baggage. They've dropped some sort of baggage. And they can see They can see you for who you are now. And they're, they're, that's who that is. Um, this person wants a piece of the cake. <laughs> I don't know where that's coming from. They, they, they see you as, I don't know where cake come from. <clears throat> I don't see any cake, but whatever. They, they want a piece. They want, whatever. Anyhow, um, seeing very, very clearly what the best choice is. Whoever you are dealing with was exploring other options. And I feel like now they, they've gotten the clarity that they need. They may have gotten it very, very sudden. I also feel on another note, there's going to be a sudden departure for you. Um, I don't know who that is. Maybe you're dealing with somebody right now and you have to make a choice. I do see a sudden change, very, very sudden with the tower. You may have to let go of something that you have been holding on to, that you have been carrying to accept this new opportunity that is better suited for you. The Knight of Wands is a suitor that is very well suited for you. Um, this person could make you extremely happy. This person, I feel like whoever it is that you're dealing with has been dealing with some upheaval in their life. I feel like whoever you are dealing with may have been confused. <clears throat> <clears throat> And that's why they haven't been communicating. I have not had any communication problems until now. None. So there's been a lack of communication because this person has been reflecting. They have been, they've been in fear too. They've been in a place of fear. I think they were afraid to let go of something that they were holding on to because they were ignoring, you know, uh, what were they ignoring? their feelings I, I feel like there's some sort of nightmare here as well so I feel like your your person whoever this person is that you have been waiting for has been involved in some sort of nightmare with somebody that you know they didn't they were afraid of the consequences if they uh, communicated with you or something like that anyway you're gonna be receiving an offer or an invite that is going to be a complete shock to you Okay, I feel like this is somebody that you already know. Maybe somebody new. I'm not sure. Um, some of you uh, need to focus on the future. You definitely have a new prospect here. I feel like I feel like you you have been unhappy. You may have been dreaming of you know having it all or something like that and thinking that you're never going to get it maybe you were you know uh, afraid that you were never going to get it i do think that you're going to get it there's there's doubt here there's doubt there's fear there's there's uh shock okay you're definitely going to be shocked this month um balance awaits i feel like you're dealing with somebody that is making a change they're, they're they they they've had to, they've had to change something in their lives to be able to to come to you with whatever it is that they were coming to you with um so yeah um what else we have a new prospect here focusing on the future this is extremely exciting going in a new direction you're gonna I feel like some of you are um, moving as well I think I already said that there's a change in the living circumstances there could also be somebody that is in a position of authority that is uh, making a decision and that affects your home so there could be even children leaving the home uh, because of the ten of cups reverse that's like a dying dream leaving the home and, and that could be for your person your person may have a hard time leaving something about the child or the children you know 
somebody is moving somebody is definitely definitely moving whether it's you or the person that we're talking about this is the best option it is the best option there's been some sort of deception maybe even self-deception we have somebody here that uh, is going to be dealing with some consequences as well consequences for lies so i don't know who has been lying but somebody has seven of cups reverse next to the moon reverse that's lies that's consequences we have somebody here that has been overdoing it i don't know if they've been overspending or they've been going overboard they They've, they've really, really overdone it, and now it's time to deal with the consequences. Somebody is traveling in a new direction. They're, they're moving to a new place. There's some sort of emotional loss here, and I feel like it's all for the best because now, now you're free. You're free of this burden. You're free of this baggage. Whether it's you or the person that you're dealing with. Dropping weight, dropping a burden, dropping baggage or responsibilities. Massive change. Which is absolutely exciting. You're going to be receiving a gift from somebody as well. This is a necessary change with the tower card. Some sort of truth is about to be revealed. This truth breaks you free from something and maybe it's something you have been mourning over. You know, if you've been mourning over a loss, you know, there's, with the five of cups, you've been mourning over a loss, you've been crying over a loss, the, things are going to change. They're going to change for the better because you're going to be so, this is a transformation. Transformation is death, right? This is, you're going to be so beautiful. You're going to feel so free. You're going to, you're going to feel so beautiful. You're going to look so beautiful. This is a new life, right? Let's try this. New prospect. You, I think this is a new opportunity. I really do. And I don't think you see it coming. The tower is very sudden. You don't see it coming. This person that is that is going to be approaching you is, is making a conscious change. But I also feel like there's going to be a change in your living situation. How, and I think that may even be two different scenarios. Some of you are moving or somebody's moving out of your house or somebody's moving into your house. This person, somebody may be moving into your house or in or out, something like that. Four of Cups reverse, seizing the opportunity, taking the opportunity, interested now, the end of stagnation. So somebody is definitely the Ace of Cups. You could say basically say it's the Ace of Cups up upright. And both and it's interesting because I, I put it next to the Five of Cups reverse, the Four of Cups reverse, both of the Three of Cups reverse as like the end of sorrow. It is. Things are going to get better. Somebody is taking an opportunity. They're taking an opportunity. This is an opportunity for love. They want it. They want it. Okay. Strength. That's your card. You're going to have to be strong. You're going to have to have courage and be brave. Somebody also sees your beauty. They see your grace. They see your purity. They see uh, your ability to master your emotions, your strength. And you're going to be get stronger. You are only going to get stronger. Now we have the Ten of Wands reversed. Again, I'm using a different deck. This is a conscious change. This is releasing baggage, dropping a weight, dropping a burden that has been holding you down. So you are letting go of something. You are letting go of something that has been holding you down. And I think that it may not be what you asked for, but it's in your best interest. It's like shedding your skin. Shedding the weight. The moon reversed again. Now we have the moon reversed twice. That is uh, a reality check. Tr 
truths being revealed. Very, very sudden. We have the Knight of Swords reversed. That is a shock. There's your tower. This isn't like a tower. This is something is going to happen that this is extreme. This is extremely shocking. Somebody is coming in and they are coming in extremely fast this month. There's no stopping this from happening. Somebody really, really loves you or they have feelings for you and they've been hiding their feelings and they're about to come, come out of the dark. It's like coming out of the darkness into the light. Some of you are dealing with a Pisces. Could be another Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Scorpio. This person is about to show their feelings. They are not going to hide them. They have a lot of passion for you. Seven of Swords. This is somebody who has been watching you. Somebody has been watching you. And they're not, they're coming back. They're coming back around. They are. You may have thought they forgot, but they didn't. Anyhow, Seven of Swords. Taking an opportunity. They want it. They want it. They see you as an opportunity for love, for a partnership. You may need to... Uh, protect yourself even or be wise or, or you know may you may have some questions for this person I wonder if this person uh, betrayed you in some way and you don't trust them there's fear with the moon both twice there's fear I feel like this person has betrayed you with the seven of swords maybe they lied to you or they cheated on you or I don't know I don't know hmm. what did this person do they Deceived you in some way. I feel like you're going to have questions for this person. You are. You're going to be questioning this person. You're going to be like, stop right there. What, what happened? Where have you been? Or what... Who are you? You know, that kind of thing. Something is about to be revealed that has been hidden. Somebody's been hiding something. They've been hiding their feelings for you. Maybe they were cheated on. Maybe they were cheated on or there's been some cheating. Maybe they in maybe that's now they've dropped the third party. We have the three of cups like twice here. And they're they wanna they wanna want you to give them a chance. Somebody wants you to give them a chance. And you're gonna be put into a position of power. Definitely somebody wants a chance. Somebody wants you to give them a chance. You're going to be challenged. You are. You've got somebody coming towards you that this is like a wounded warrior, right? This person has been hurt. They they want you to give them a chance. So there's somebody that wants you. To, and now we got the Ten of Wands reversed again. So we could say that's the third time. This is this is a conscious making a conscious to whoever you are with or whoever we're talking about wants a chance with you. They are willing to do whatever it takes. You're also going to be releasing something that you have been holding on to that has been weighing you down. This is the beginning of a new life. Everything is going to turn out as it should. There could be some news of legalities. There even could be a judge that is making a decision that is affecting your life. 
This may not be what you asked for, but everything is going to turn out as it should. Somebody may be leaving. Eight of Cups reversed. There could also be an apology. I do believe that you may receive an apology from somebody. Somebody could even be so saying, I'm sorry, I'm leaving. Or you may be saying that to somebody. Either way, this month, you're going to be, this big month, okay, it's a month of transformation and change. Get prepared to receive a message from somebody that absolutely shocks you in the love department. Good luck.